500 buckle. In this tutorial, I'm just going to show you how you can create an interesting cracked surface, sort of like uh, maybe cracked leather or something like that. Now, first thing to do, just quickly go over to Effects, and I'm going to go for Esoterica, and Make Mosaic and Tessellation. Select that. Once you've done that, just quickly go over to Action, and Make Tessellation. Now, first option, you've got pieces, cracks, and triangles. I'm going to go for cracks, and I'm going to go for random. Add 500 points. This is probably the quickest way of doing it. I mean, you can, of course, just go along there, but I'm just going to quickly add 500 points. Click it again, and you can see straight away you've got this light, really nice cracked surface now appearing. Add, add, and add. And of course, you can do it as many times as you wish, depending on your system. Now I'm just going to go for that. Click OK. Right, once you've actually got the design, once you've actually got that cracked surface, it doesn't particularly look very sort of like a surface of material itself. So what you can do, of course, you can just go to Effects and Surface Control and apply surface texture. Then just basically move around the light to the point where you are happy. And I'm going to go with that. And you can modify the softness. Now, sometimes if you go too far to softness, you end up with this. It's not so nice. So, so also the key thing here is the image illuminance. Set that on. Don't go with the paper or etc. But image illuminance. And just set just the softness to the just about there. Looks about right. And now, so it moves that around. You can modify the amount. So you reduce that down. It doesn't look so effective again. Just put it up to about there, and you modify the shine, uh, just about there. And there you have it, nice sort of three-dimensional, bumpy sort of cracked surface texture in Painter. Hope you found this of interest. Thank you very much.